Following the revelation by Kaduna State Governor Senator Vesani on the huge debt inherited from his predecessor Malam Nasir Arifai on May 29, 2023, declaring that the state is now hugely indebted, the revelation states that Kaduna State owes about 115 billion Naira contractual liabilities, which was inherited from the previous administration, with many road projects yet to be completed. Galaxy TV correspondent has details in this report. The construction industry serves as one of the key players of the nation's economic growth, considering its role in infrastructural development, revenue generation, provision of jobs and shelter for the masses, enriching the aesthetical view and influencing the growth of other key sectors of the nation. Investigation by Galaxy TV's correspondent shows the multi-billion Naira contracts awarded by previous administrations in Kaduna State have not been completed and monies released were yet to be accounted for. Some of the road projects for which contracts were awarded in Zaria, Kafanchan, Chikong, Kaduna North and Kaduna South local government areas and by all indications, the projects have been abandoned. This has left motorists, businesses and residents in these areas with more troubles, especially as they face these challenges that has affected businesses in the areas. I don't know how to explain myself because I'm even tired of this situation. I'm a businessman. I, I, I deal with uh, building materials, but since everything is destroyed, it's not even the destroyed. There's nothing that is moving there. Is nothing that is moving here. Everybody, if you check the mechanic there, even to a car, even cars don't used to pass here, even a machine, you use your machine and pass this road. Maybe the rest they start buying papers. It has been smooth before, but they say that they want to lay two lanes and they scatter, you know, look at rain everywhere, car and all, car are falling here every day. People are crying here. Please, we are begging for the government to come to see what is happening here. They have commissioned the road from uh, Mopo Barak to Barnawa, but all this Chukun side, there is nothing they do here. These motorists lament that some of the road projects are said to have been abandoned by the contractors at early stages after collecting mobilization fees and have been left unattended to for years. I am not happy. Since when Aerofire destroyed this road, our market is not moving. We are not even getting money again myself to feed our family. No, no, we are not happy about this road, especially this rainy season now. We they suffer where we If you wash your bike, if you just pass here once, your, you, you, even your clothes will wear myself and got tons somehow. So really we are not happy about this road. Kaduna residents therefore appeal to the present governor to help complete the abandoned road project as it has affected the businesses and sources of livelihood. Yeah, is that. If the customer wants to come, you say the road is very bad. But we are praying that this governor that is available now, and we are praying that whatever happens, you look us and you help us and make this road to be possible. They the truth is that if you look at this road, it has affected our business here. We are calling on to the governor to help us and do this road because the road has stayed long unattended to. This was a busy road. But see what they have reduced it to. The road is down like a bush. Please, the government should help us and fix the road.